box. So there we go. Um, so we kind of got a frame here and whatnot in order to really make it look like it's, it's supposed to be bunk or whatever. I'm going to actually add a piece of ladder here just so you can actually climb up here. Uh, and up here is where I'm going to go ahead and add because I don't think I can actually go up. Yeah, I thought so. I am so glad there wasn't any redstone there. Or was there? Holy shit. I can't tell. Let me put another ladder here because I don't want to go into there and actually mess up my redstone. And, ooh, thank goodness there wasn't. Uh, but, uh, yeah, so we're not going to be able to go up much further, unfortunately. So let me just break that ladder down, fill in that space, and there we go. So, look, it's going to look kind of like nobody could actually sleep in these beds, but uh, it should at least look pretty cool. So we're going to just set that there, get some half tiles, and kind of like that. So I'll probably do the half tiles here first. That makes a nice dark area. Isn't that cute? Um, and there we go. Not much I can do about that nice dark area. It's too small for anything to spawn, so it's not a big deal. But there you go. Now it looks like there's kind of a bed up there, um, I guess. You know, whatever. Set a light there, that way it doesn't look so cut off, I guess. And there we go, so there's a little darkness there, but I think that looks kind of neat. And then I can just set up another one here. Uh, so that's kind of what I'm doing. It's a nice, cute little makeshift bed, I think, that way. I'm trying to think of how I want to block that off, because it just doesn't look good. Um, let me just block it off with some stone. There and there. That'll look good. Just make a little stone block or whatever. Like that, I guess. So, yeah, to just kind of make a little bunks, just to make it look like it's a barracks, I guess. Um, not super duper high. We'll have some low bunks, like over here or something. Some single bunks. Those are kind of double bunks. I don't know why they're that big, but, you know, whatever. Obviously, they're too small for anyone to actually sleep in, but, meh. As long as it gets the idea across, who cares, right? So over here, we'll set it up. Up there, I need a ladder. Like, I don't know. Right here, I guess. I think it looks kind of neat that way. Wow, these are a lot shorter. Tuh. There we go. That looks better. Alright, so there. And some fluffies. And some half steps. And there we go. So there's some more bunks. I don't think we have enough room here for any more bunks. Put some single bunks right here. That would look pretty cool. It wouldn't be very big though. 
so I'll pass on that. Alright, so we'll have some bunks like right down here. Just to straighten things out, I guess. So there we go. I, I guess that looks like a barracks to me. I don't know how perfect it is. You know, that looks like a nice cramped barracks to me. <laughs> so hopefully that works for you guys too. I think it looks pretty cool. That is still pretty neat. I mean, it does look like bunks. And they have little ladders and everything to get up to the higher bunks. And I think that's pretty neat. Not a ton of room here. But I figure, you know, I can always add more barracks. But that's kind of how I, I've seen one way to do beds. And I kind of like that way. I think it looks pretty cool. I mean, I don't have to have wood at the bottom, obviously. But I did that just for the sake of, of making things look like they're actual bunks, I guess. But anyway, guys, so there's our barracks. We look outside, it's all nice. So, maybe I should turn that. You know, if I turn that, maybe it'll just look better. Because to be honest, that one just looks kind of odd otherwise. Shoot, I don't have an axe on me. It's okay. So we're just going to turn this around. I mean, there's enough room for that. What am I bringing that down for? Don't need to. So what I'll do is we'll just kind of do that with it. Actually, we'll do that with it. Just since that's like a bunk bed, there we go, and then we just kind of like that. So there we go. I guess that works. That that'll work for me. Oh, and that gives a little more room, and that looks a little better, I think. Yeah, I can live with that. So there you go. There's our barracks. Um, nice small <laughs> shared bunks, I guess. Whatever. And then you just kind of come up here above the barracks and you're at the armory. Pretty simple. Uh, I guess that works. Looks, looks kind of nice, I think. So, let's go ahead and get the armory doors in here. I like that. I think that looks good. I think more of the lower, like, level armor and stuff I'll keep out here, maybe. And then the higher stuff, like gold or diamond or, you know, higher level armor and weapons, we'll actually keep in the uh, armory vault here or something. I don't know. Something to think about. I want to get out there and actually work on the surrounding area a bit. So we'll just cut through the barracks here. I get some signs for all that, of course. Let's see where our little area is here. I'm just going to dig out all the scrap at this point. Frankly, I think it's just doesn't way now. There we go. That just looks a little better to me. Just dig all that out too. This is obviously where the armory is. And right now I'm going to leave it as it is. Maybe one day we'll we'll dig out some obsidian and we'll case the entire uh, secure area of the armory in obsidian just to make it 
look, you know, that much more secure or something. Uh, I think that'll be pretty cool. In the meantime, I'll just kind of pull that out, and we're just going to put some lights on it, like so. There we go. So just set that up like that, I guess, and, and be done with it for now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it looks odd. I know, but what can you do? There we go. I guess that will work. So there. That'll work. Put these flowers away. So hopefully you guys think that's kind of nice. It's nice to see this really flushing out around the mountain. There's still a ton of area in front, and I'm still not 100% sure where I'm going to put the control room. I was thinking about putting it upstairs near the greenhouse, like underneath the greenhouse or something, so it can really see outside, and I still might do that, but there's so much room down around uh, here that I just might set it... I just, uh, I'm going to get rid of that, because I might as well. Uh, might just set it down here. I, I, I just don't know yet. But, uh, we've we got a barracks over here. I might put another barracks, like, over here or something. I don't know. Uh, it's a thought. But I kind of like the way that looks. It definitely gives a little something more here to the front than there was. I definitely need to get more some signs out and more stuff situated. I'm going to be filling out some more storage rooms and whatnot um, and all that fun stuff. Connection to station primary, of course, which we haven't finished. Uh, we've got an empty storeroom here or some sort of room here. I need to finish cutting out the rest of the tree farm here above the tree level uh, so I can replant it. We used quite a bit of wood there, and I'm definitely going to be using a lot more before everything is said and done. I may expand this. I don't know yet. If it happens, I, I don't know what's going to happen. But it'll probably happen sometime. It'll be expanded mostly out this way. I don't think I'm going to expand it much this way, mainly because I have a lot of this already intact, and I don't want to break all that glass. It's kind of a waste. So expanding it out that way.